when hanuma vihari put out a very emotional post stating that he is never going to play for andhra again it ruffled a lot of feathers it was indeed a very very sad way as to how a state association treated one of their stalwarts but now the aca andhra cricket association and hanuma vihari situation is going to escalate a bit further because hanuma vihari has been issued a show cause notice by the aca explaining the actions of what happened after andhra's disastrous exit in the ranji trophy quarter final now this show cause notice by the andhra cricket association is only going to escalate situations further hanuma vihari has not responded to it the one of the ac officials speaking to pti has stated what was the reason to give the show cause notice and rather if you look at it it is a kind of damage control that the aca want to do at this point in time because speaking to pti aca has issued a show cause notice to hanuma vihari but hanuma vihari has not responded to it aca they have given the show cause notice for two reasons one they value hanuma vihari they want to ensure that he does not go out of andhra pradesh and the second thing chances to iron out the grievances these are the two things but why did the andhra cricket association wait for two months for this why couldn't a situation could happen at that particular point in time there are two explanations maybe hanuma vihari was not really wanting to talk to the aca looking at what has happened second ACA was still trying to get their house in order remember this is one of the state associations that's fighting a whole lot of issues that is there so ACA wanted to get its house in order the defeat to madhya pradesh in the quarter final didn't help and that is why hanuma vihari also did not want to be uh, speaking to the ACA after what had happened but what exactly happened in order to refresh your memory let me take you back to what happened in the knockout stages of the ranji trophy in 2024 at that time andhra had lost to mp and it was by a very close margin but after that there was a very very you may say controversial post by hanuma vihari wherein he said he will never play for andhra again and on instagram he alleged he was forced to step down after andhra's first game against bengal you all remember that ricky bui took over the captaincy but hanuma vihari stepped down due to personal reasons but then after andhra's exit you saw an even graver picture emerge because at that time after andhra lost to mp political interference one of the players one of the andhra players he was the 17th player in the andhra squad hanuma vihari had you had allegedly used abusive language and andhra players had actually said that okay this kind of thing happens but the player in question k n prithviraj he had stated that yes he abused me and that's why he complained and his father is reportedly an mp and he complained to the aca and the aca said vihari has to step down after all this happened when vihari gave out the statement that yes he is not going to play for andhra again all the andhra players signed a letter in just been in unison with hanuma vihari they appealed to the aca to not take his name away let him stay with andhra let him be the captain but then now there is a stalemate k n prithviraj the guy in question he alleged that there was false allegations against me and that vihari did abuse him so in the whole kerfuffle what has happened is andhra cricket association and hanuma vihari there was no communication with them after the ranji trophy fiasco and that is why ACA now is issuing a show cause notice a good month after the end of the after their campaign ended in the Ranji Trophy. Who do you think is at fault here? Hanuma Vihari because he used abusive language reportedly, reportedly using an, uh, abusive language, or do you think the ACA just cannot think right? It seems to be that ACA does not want to value Hanuma Vihari. That is why he gave that emotional outburst on uh, Instagram. That yes, I do not want to play for Andhra again because there's just been no backing. We hope that the situation between the ACA and Hanuma Vihari is resolved because if ACA lose Hanuma Vihari, it is ACA's loss more, not Hanuma Vihari's. 
Thank you so much folks for joining us for this video. We'll be back with more updates on sports today. Tap that bell icon so you know when we go live. And don't forget we are on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram as well. Bye-bye.